Good morning, boys and girls. It's Mr. Grable in our grade three math class. And today is Jersey Day, so I'm wearing my Edmonton Oilers jersey. Get on your favorite jersey and let's enjoy a book today called Two Halves or Four Quarters. All about fractions. We've been learning about fractions. Here we go. This boy looks like he cut his apple in half, two parts. This girl, she cut her sandwich in quarters, four parts. Mm -hmm. Brad and his big sister Christy were making some sandwiches for lunch. My sandwich is a square, said Christy. It has four sides and four corners. My sandwich is a square too, said Brad. I'm going to cut it in half. I've made two smaller sandwiches, said Brad, but they are not squares. They are rectangles. There he cut it, and now you have half, and they turn into rectangles. Hmm, cool. Christy said, now I'm going to cut my big sandwich in half. But I'm not going to make two rectangles. I'm going to make two triangles. She started cutting at one of the corners of her sandwich. Oh, I think she's going diagonal. <gasps> it worked. Christy cut all the way through her sandwich. You've made two triangles, said Brad. They have three sides and three corners. I will cut them in half again, said Christy. Then I'll have four little triangles. Well, there she is. There's the two she cut. So she's cut her sandwich in half. Now she's going for quarters. I've cut my big square sandwich into quarters, said Christy. Now I have four little triangles. And there they are. Wow, she did do it. I made quarters too, said Brad. I cut my rectangles in half. And now I have four little squares. There you go. Try this out with your sandwiches. Fractions. We can have this apple with our lunch, said Christy. I'll cut it in half. An apple is like a ball, said Brad. So half an apple would be like half a ball. Yes, you're right, said Christy. There they are, kind of like a sphere. Number 3D objects here. I can see a circle in my half of the apple, said Brad. And I can see a circle in your half, too. Look there, they cut it in half. And now there's circle parts. Hmm. Faces. Look, Christy, my half and your half make a whole apple again, said Brad. Yes, they do, said Christy. Now let's eat our lunch. My favorite. Eating. Yum, yum. Hopefully you like that story. Two halves and four quarters. Have a good day. We'll talk to you later.